way we go about it is we open the Scan Explorer tool in RealWorks. Um, now there's a whole heap of stuff we can do in here in Scan Explorer, but the workflow we're looking at today, we're going to be creating using this Create Entities in SketchUp tool. So if I click on that, it will open a SketchUp project for me. Um, and I'll just delete old mate and minimise that. And in here, uh, we have different ways of extracting features from, from this point cloud. Um, create, extract points, and there's also an automatic corner detection function in there, which is quite handy. So basically pull a polygon around the corner and it'll, it'll figure out where the corner actually is for you. Um, you can extract edge lines um, similar way um, with that tool there. And extract wall edges will basically extract all the edge lines for the whole shell of the, the point cloud that you have. But the tool I want to demonstrate today is this walls using two face points tool. So if I select it and then I'll go in and click on floor and then the roof in my scan, uh, which basically will define the, the Z limits for the vertical surfaces that I want to extract. Um, and then I simply go around and select those surfaces, the walls in this room and columns or anything else that you have in there that you that you want to extract as well. Let's go around on each of the walls. Click on them twice. And I mean, while I'm in here, I could also extract beams, cornices, areas, anything else um, as well. But for this exercise, I'll just do the walls roof and floor. So once I've selected on all those, um, I'll hit create and then I'm simply going to sketch up and there's my 3D model of my room extracted from the point cloud data. Um, and in SketchUp here you've got a, a lot of other design tools to to move forward from that to uh, complete your design. That's about it. Thanks.